I have criminology in 15 minutes because we ended early. Or will it just be like exam four? No, you guys suck on each individual exam. So I'm not going to make you remember everything. <laughs> <laughs> Our belief that rehabilitation is not And the other one. I don't. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, what's going on? Hi, vlog. Hello. Don't go on dates with people who have COVID. That's okay. That's <laughs> my advice. <laughs> I don't know why, but I've always wanted somebody to like get the fight for me. You know what I'm talking about? Yes. <laughs> like I don't want people to fight, but like I just want them to be like, no, fuck, I love her. <laughs> and I'm like, oh. Me being like, oh my gosh, because guys don't fight over you. Yeah, what? Kind of not be fun mean. for me. We oh, hate Jake Jones. I have six minutes. Bye, Bye. Bye. Changing psychoanalytic concepts of social life from Freud to Erickson. So it would be mostly like on how Freud is biased. That's the gist. Okay, awesome. I like that. So I know I met all the points that were needed to be met. <laughs> you're more mentally sound. <laughs> well, imagine like halfway through the paper, you're just writing and then you just like, you just start typing and then you realize you just had an existential crisis in the paper. And I feel like, I feel like somehow that would work out for you. I, I don't even know what's going on anymore, dude. <laughs> so I would have guessed that you were either a Leo or a Aquarius, but you have a, like a Leo rising. I would have guessed like a Virgo rising more than like being a Virgo, but like totally a Virgo energy ha hands down. <laughs> okay, I'm just about to start dating an Aquarius man and I'm kind of scared about it. Run. <laughs> like, oh my God. Yeah, it could just be men. It could just be that. Virgo guys are just dangerous men. <laughs> the gaslighting kings. Yo, we about to go to a freaking frat party. So I'll let you know if we go do anything freaking fun tonight, but that's what's going on. I've literally been watching Shameless for like four hours and just like listening to music and that's all I fucking do with my life. Fit check, hi, sorry, this top, thrifted, necklace, dolls kill. Ass, mine, jeans, pretty little thing. And Converse. to my dance class. I'm taking modern dance. It's a one credit <laughs> intro to modern dance class. It's so easy and I haven't been in so long because it's not mandatory and I was sick and blah blah blah. Anywho, so I'm going to that. So I'm going to show you what I can from that class. So we'll see. It's fine, totally cool. I don't really care that much. It's but not like I like really want to fucking see her in concert or anything. 2,000 people <gasps> ahead of me? Oh my god, yeah. I think you should need certification of having a broken heart during COVID to be able to go to this concert. It, it just caps out and says like 2,000 plus and it could actually be like 4,000. Oh my god, oh my god, it's loading. Oh my god, it's almost sold out. Holy tit. What? What do you mean someone beat me to those seats? Oh my fucking god. Sydney, do you want to break both your legs to get wheelchair seats? Yes, what the fuck? <laughs> this is my 13th reason. Thank you. Yo, so I decided last minute to go to a concert tonight. I'm going to see Upsal, who's one of my favorite 
love her so much. I bought the tickets at two because she tweeted, she's like, Tucson, I'm in you or whatever the fuck. And I was like, oh shit, gotta go. I wasn't gonna do anything tonight. So now I'm gonna go into this. I'm going with my friend Sage and my other friend Leah. Fuck studying for finals. There's concerts we gotta go to. Like, there's shit we gotta do. There's parties. Like, fuck school. I'm just almost done with it. I'm like, I don't fucking care. I think that throwing over like a giant oversized like leather coat is like always a good move to try to like unfancy an outfit. This dress, pretty little thing. This jacket, sheen. Boots, dolls kill. Necklace, it's an Aries symbol because I'm an astrology bitch. My boyfriend. Who said that? My boyfriend got it for me. Cause I, I'm a Cancer, obviously, if you can't tell. Uh, but I have an Aries moon, which is my chart ruler. Sage is picking us up at like 6.30 to go get food and then the concert doors open at 7.30 and then start to eight, so. Also the sunset. Look how pretty she is. We're gonna be so close, I'm gonna die. I know, I've never been so close to an artist before. You don't even know who this is. I don't even know who this is. <laughs> Broken, sad, ripping my heart out. You're, You're <laughs> so immature. <laughs> hey babe, so it's Sunday. I have six days until I grow to a, oh fuck me. I hate that. Anywho, <laughs> basically today I just literally like woke up and I've been working on criminology notes all day or like criminal justice administration, whatever the fuck. I've been working on that all day because I need to put all my notes from the book into a Google doc and then I need to go put all that shit into a Quizlet. And hopefully if I stop getting distracted by shit, <laughs> then I can actually focus. Yeah, so I'm basically planning to have some friends over to the pool of my apartment, which I've never fucking gone to. I kind of went to, but I didn't go swimming. I just like went and hung out with people there because there was like a party going on. But I'm gonna try to have like friends over and have like a little graduation celebration thing because like every Everyone I know is like leaving on Tuesday and then I'm here for like another week So I'm kind of like take a shot every time I say anywho my dad pointed out that I say that every five seconds But like I can't not do it Anywho, so basically yesterday I wrote a song. I've been wanting to write music for like years I have tried to write songs my entire life and I fucking suck at it. I had my first big heartbreak And then I had my first like mm, we're so in love moment Ugh, Fucking, fucking gross gosh. shit and then I learned how to write songs better and so I have a ton of songs written. I've just been waiting for a friend that has some fucking producing skills or like songwriting skills to like help teach me how to fucking do it. And so I got with my friend Sage yesterday. Basically, Sage, I will leave the link down below. They wrote a song called 42 and has over a million streams on fucking Spotify. They're amazing at songwriting and all that. So I was like, I need you to teach me how to do this. So we literally wrote a song for like four hours and we basically literally finished the whole fucking thing. Like got the chords laid out, fixed the lyrics, figured out melody like we basically got the whole thing it's called her time as of right now who knows title could change like whatever but that's the title I was going with I, I really like the message behind it it's basically about dating someone who sucked, sucked. and so it's like a song to the girl
girl that he's dating now, basically being like, I know exactly what's going on in your relationship. He's done this a thousand times before. It's like no fucking surprise. Basically, it's kind of like her time's almost up. I can tell when this shit's gonna end. Like I, I, can I can map it out for you. Like this is what's happening. Anyways, that was really exciting. And then we got Subway. And then I hung out with my boy for a bit. It was very chill, relaxed. And I really procrastinated doing a lot of shit. And I really should have been editing videos. I got like a little bit into one of my videos that I'm editing. And then I really need to film another one today and I need to edit more of that. And then I need to finish these fucking notes. And then I'm having a fucking party. So I'm like, what the fuck? This shit's so hard on me. I don't know. Basically, that's just my update and synopsis of yesterday from the bits and pieces of me <laughs> recording a song and like not making any sense and blah, 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 whatever. I will let you know what's going on later today. Hi guys. I just did notes all day. Super fucking boring. Whatever. You guys don't give a fuck. This is the last week of fucking college vlog and you want to see me do some fucking college bullshit. We're getting ready. My friends are coming over and probably I should have started getting ready about 30 minutes ago. O'clock. <laughs> I'm having some of my girlies over. We're going to the pool. This is kind of the somewhat grad party that I'm getting considering we're remodeling our house at home so I can't have like a family friends one and then I'm moving and everyone's leaving like way earlier than I'm leaving. Oh my gosh, out. no. Have a Tana Mojo <laughs> moment just like that. Tana Mojo. Share a birthday, June 24th. Oh shit, you're a cancer too. Yep. Oh my god, I Barely. love that. Barely. 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 You have Gemini tendencies. Do you want to the last time you went to the gym? Oh yeah, that was not good. I tried lifting for the first time, it went really poorly. This is perfect. Oh my gosh, the lighting is great. My whole fit's from Dolls Kill. Either Zaffle or Shein, but probably Shein. This is Bethany, by the way. Oh yeah, I'm Bethany. <laughs> I'm Leah. And this is from H&M. Hi, I'm, I'm Kelsey, Leah. and my swimsuit's from I'm Shein. Yeah. Hi, I'm Lauren, and Target. Like half of your height? <laughs> <laughs> Fireball. Middle aged mom's doing water aerobics. Oh, shit. Send. Baptism. <laughs> Harry Styles era. <gasps> frat boy Harry 10 frat out of 10. Of course it fucking is. Frat dude, they talk to they want to be fat boys. That's not any better. It just means they're no, too I lame know. to get into the frat. No, I know. That's what I'm saying. What's your favorite memory of us? Oh my gosh. There's a lot that are my favorite. Aww. When we met those people with the ass tattoos. Oh my god, we uh, witnessed a bunch of guys get ass tattoos. Two people got lip tattoos that said TDX and one guy got an ass tattoo that says UATDX and he literally goes to ASU. Tell them what your favorite memory of us is together. My favorite memory is the first day I met Taylana. <laughs> that, was, that was fun. That was a fun night and she protected me the whole night. Come for my, my girls that I yeah. met five minutes before. <laughs> Who was he talking about? I think it was me and Kelsey. He's saying this could be us, but you're playing. He doesn't even know I'm playing. <laughs> My favorite memory of Tay and I is when we first met, and you say this from that weird creepy tall guy. I love that. Oh, yeah. Oh, my yeah. God. Okay. I love you too. Matt, what's your favorite memory of us? Oh, God. I'm not gonna <laughs> like what I'm about to say. Is it? Is it when I kiss? Yes. <laughs> it's so funny. It was so funny. Oh, fuck towels. We don't need that. I'm <laughs> 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 